We had a great one today. So a couple of hours ago, I, I did post my, which many of you have seen. Uh, thank you for all the comments, by the way. I really appreciate it. Um, I was happy to share my thoughts, you know, regarding the pride and joy that we have being fathers. But, you know, I was working out and I thought, you know, there was something that I missed. And I wanted to double back and tap back in with you guys. And the thing that I missed is to all the fathers out there, like me, who on this day, uh, we don't have the, we don't have the privilege anymore of wishing our own dads happy Father's Day. We don't have that privilege to call or text or even see them in person, give them a hug, a kiss on the cheek and say, hey, I love you, happy Father's Day. Um, and it was just my moment just to acknowledge you guys out there because it's a, it's a tricky thing that we have to contend with. I feel where just as men were raised by our fathers and especially there's a lot of you guys out there like me who had a, uh, a tough love complicated relationship with our fathers. I had that with my old man. I know a lot of you guys did too as well. So it's tricky because they're not here now and we wish they were, I do. I wish he was here one more time so I could say, hey, I love you, happy Father's Day. Thank you for raising me with, with the capacity of which you did have. Um, even though at times it was complicated and at times we fought, but you know we don't have that privilege. So, um, it's tricky because we're trying to, because we have such joy of being a father and what that means to our children, our little girls, our little boys. And there's no greater joy in the world, no greater inspiration than that of being a dad. But the tricky part is it's like, shit, I wish my old man was here one more time so I can say, hey, happy Father's Day, just one more time. And you know, I, I always say this and I'll share this with you guys is, if you guys have your old man around, to all my guys out there, if your dad is still around, and even if things might get a little tricky sideways sometimes, sometimes they're fucked up, I get it. I've been in that situation with my old man. It might be complicated. If your old man is around, give him a call. Try and reconcile that stuff. Try and bring it back together. Uh, now, it's a lot easier for me to say because my old man's not here, but I've been through it and I know what it's like. And from from a man who's experienced both sides of this coin, I can tell you guys that the alternative is something that I don't want you to experience. And that alternative is you guys fight. Like I fought with my old man. I got in the biggest fight, Christmas of 2019. I got in the biggest fight with my old man. Biggest fight I've had in my life with him and, and, and his as well with me. We fought um, and we weren't talking or I wasn't talking. And three weeks later, he dropped dead. And that was it. And I never had a chance to say goodbye. And I never even had a chance to reconcile um, what we were going through. Yeah, I got goosebumps right now. Um, so I tell you guys, if you guys have your old man, if your dad is still around and you're going through it, you're going through some complicated shit, reconcile, do your best to reconcile it because the alternative is something could happen. And then all of a sudden you're writing the eulogy for your dad's funeral. Like I found myself all of a sudden, I woke up one day, he was gone. And I had to write that eulogy and deliver it. So I don't want that for you guys. If you have an opportunity, if your old man is around, you do have a shot to reconcile it. So, all right, I'm gonna try and uh, uptick this to, <laughs> into something that, that's feeling positive and optimistic uh, to all the guys out there who don't have a dad. Their dads are up in heaven like mine. This one is for those guys. All our dads are up there looking down on us now. Um, hopefully they're proud of what they see. All right, I love you guys, and happy, happy Father's Day, soul man, and uh, you guys out there have a happy Father's Day.